is the intersection of Weston Road and Dennis Avenue, and it may just be one of the best lit intersections in the city. In fact, if you count, you can see that there are more than a dozen light posts over there, enough to make one viewer contact us to find out why. Well, it turns out that this is actually an art installation, and at night is when it really shines. The installation is called Nyctophilia, meaning the love of the night. Artists Daniel Young and Christian Giroux, who couldn't appear on camera today, say their creation creates a public space on a neglected city corner, using basic infrastructure to capture the area's industrial heritage. And they say with over 20 distinct randomized lighting programs, the work assumes a different personality each night and was selected by jury after public consultation. And this is just one step forward on beautifying the area, which is in very much need of uh, beautification. Well, this art installation was actually unveiled back in 2014. And some say it has now become the unofficial gateway to Mount Dennis. Pretty holiday looking, like Christmassy sort of. Uh, usually like bright green and orange, that kind of stuff. Do residents like it generally? Has it been a good addition to the neighborhood? Uh, sure. Uh, I think they would say it's very different. Uh, I guess that's a good thing. There's a different sort of art piece in the neighborhood. A local real estate development generated close to $200,000 in funding for the project through Section 37 benefits, a part of the Ontario's Planning Act, which allows the city to ask for benefits to construct or improve facilities when a development requires a zoning bylaw amendment. The artist has, has won a number of awards for this project, so I think it's beautiful and it's a good good news story uh, for Mount Dennis. And that is the explanation of why there are so many lights on this unassuming intersection in Mount Dennis. In Toronto, Audra Brown, City News.